Hi lovelies, welcome back to another video. So today is going to be a poly gel nails full set. But before I jump into the video, of course, I have to give a huge shout out to my notification squad. These were the first three people to comment on my last video. So today I am going to be trying out the McCart Nail Extension Gel Pink Kit. And my nails are going to be looking really whack throughout this review until I start my actual design because I did go ahead and prep and apply my tip and shape them and all of that so really quickly I'm just going to go ahead and do an unboxing and then I'm gonna come back and talk to you guys about everything that comes inside of the kit but I just want you to see the packaging which is totally adorable it is this gorgeous baby pink sort of box with extra detailing the line work and all of that the borders on the boxes it's just super cute and then inside of the box every single thing is pink all the boxes, everything that comes inside is pink. So this kit does come with a 6 watt mini foldable LED nail lamp. And I really love these because there are no buttons on them. They do use this USB cord. But the McCart ones click like a mouse. So you don't have to fight up to look for a button or to press a button. And it does have a pre-set timer now i would say this is not really to cure the poly gel all the way through but i would use it for flash curing the top and underneath of my nails and even though this is just like plug and go it does come with a really tiny user manual and this is one thing i really enjoy with the mccart brand no matter how little of a product it is they do supply you with that user manual on the specifications and how to use it and every inch of detail like they don't miss out on that so next we have this box and it says beautiful glitter powders and as you can see it looks just like the outside of the box with the same line work and everything and inside of this box i believe there are a whole bunch of different things so the first thing that i'm pulling out now is the rhinestones you do get a set of ab and clear rhinestones and i absolutely love these rhinestones now these are not swarovski crystals but the shine that you get on these for regular rhinestones is amazing and i absolutely love these now you do get some dual forms as well as nail forms and i really don't use these types of nail forms and the last thing inside of this box are these four glitters by McCart. Now this is the same four glitters that I got in another poly gel kit that I reviewed by the McCart company. And I do have a review on that and I would have it in the cards on the screen so you guys know which kit I'm talking about. So I did not use this set in this video nor did I even bother to open it and you do get this really big user manual now it tells you everything that comes inside of the package as well as how to put it on and how to remove it and one thing i do admire about the mccart company is that they take their customers into consideration when they are producing these booklets because they do also include frequently asked questions in the majority of the booklets that i receive in these packages and I really and truly appreciate that as a customer you know you might have a question or two and you can see the question and answers on the other side of this booklet and you do get a lot of frequently asked questions in this one because it's so big and then at the back of it you do have a brochure of a few of the McCart products that they offer and a few products on here I actually use personally which is the sanding bands the hand files the nail drill bits and the foil gel and I do have them on my Amazon storefront so inside of the package I'm just running through everything that came in the layout which is a mini base and top coat a two-in-one surface cleanser you can also use it as a slip solution and this really cute pink gel brush now it does look like the black mccart brush same size and everything it just does not have any writing on it so you do have your brush on one end and the spatula on the other and another thing that is really adorable now i use the black to these but this is the pink and it's a 180 grit washable hand file and i love these and lastly we do have six tubes each at 15 ml with the nail extension gel so i'm just going to really quickly swatch these 
and I do leave the tubes on the screen so you guys can see which number goes with which color because the swatches on the outside of the tubes do not do the colors that are inside any justice at all and you do get a clear poly gel in this set as well so I am going to go ahead and finish swatching these out for you guys really quickly and then I'm going to come back and actually start my nail design So for the design today, I am using the 2-in-1 cleanser as my slip solution and there is a really easy pour nozzle on the top of this which I absolutely love so it's not going to spill everywhere. This gold and pink glitter mix is by the Veronica shop and the snowflakes that I'm using is also by the Veronica shop and I will have my affiliate link in the description box below. Remember if you follow the link, you're discount is automatically applied at checkout but if you were to go to the website you can use the coupon code which is also in my description box below to apply that discount so what i'm doing now is my nails have already been prepped as i mentioned before so i did go in with my apre gel x primer and i apply that to my natural nails on top of that i am going to be applying the base coat so everything that i'm using besides the glitter mixes are by the mccart company the poly gels came in the kit the base and top as well as you guys saw before so i'm using that the only thing i did not use was the pink brush because i didn't want to mess it up it was super cute so i did go in and use two of the black ones that i had before and the tips that I'm wearing are also by the McCart company and I would link that in my description box below. So what I'm going to be doing to the pinky finger and the thumb is I'm going in with this really light translucent pink poly gel. And I actually put too much on my pinky nails. I did have to go in and remove some because I do want a nice thin layer. And as I lay the poly gel on the entire nail, I am going to be creating a sort of a glitter fade with the pink and gold glitter mix so i'm going to start pressing that glitter mix into the wet poly gel and after i'm happy with the placement of the glitter i'm going to go in and put a snowflake right to the bottom between the ombre and my nail plate and then i'm going to go ahead and put my hand into the light and i do give it a flash cure for about 15 seconds so i do want to let you guys know that i've had this kit for a while i posted when i received it on my instagram feed and a few weeks ago not a few weeks ago last week when i was about to post this video mccart told me that it was actually out of stock so i was waiting for it to come back into stock so i can share it with you guys before it goes again and it is finally back in stock so i would link the kit in my description box below i really think it's a fabulous idea especially for somebody who's not very familiar with poly gel and just wants to put a foot into the water to try it out to see how you like it this would be perfect because you have more than one shade you have your clear every single thing that you need to do a full set the tubes really aren't that big because they are only 15 ml which is the size of a gel polish bottle but the quality of the mccart poly gel is absolutely amazing it's very easy to work with and to be honest with you guys this is the first time that i worked with the slip solution i always use alcohol and i really and truly enjoyed working with the slip solution i didn't have to clean my brush as fast as i would have if i were working with my alcohol because it evaporates so quickly that you have to be constantly back and forth this slip solution actually keeps the brush a little bit more moisturized than if i were working with my alcohol and looking at this glitter mix on camera right now as i'm doing my voiceover is so mesmerizing like how cute is she Oh my gosh if you love this glitter mix as much as i am loving it right now take a minute and give this video a big thumbs up
and on my ring finger i am going in with this bobby pink and i'm placing it to the cuticle area making sure that cuticle area is really nicely covered with that poly gel and then i'm going to pull it as far to the free edge of my extension as possible and again before curing i am going to be pressing some of my pink and gold glitter mix and snowflakes into the wet poly gel before i give it a freeze cure for 15 seconds and I'm not sure if you guys can tell but this design was sort of like just me going with the flow and winging it because of the fact that I didn't plan what I was about to do as you guys can see my right hand is not completed at all usually when I come on my right hand is normally completed or halfway completed and I do have gloves on one hand but because I wasn't sure what I wanted to do I went in and recorded this hand first and honestly I'm really glad that I did so you're going to see me pop back in later on in the video with my both hands looking all pink and cute and if you made it to this point of the video leave me this pink emoji with your comments in the comment section below and if you're not yet subscribed please click on that subscribe button down below and join the notification squad by clicking on the bell icon right next to that big red button so that you don't miss out whenever your girl uploads a new video So on the ring finger and the index finger, I am going to be doing a fade. So I thought I was recording when I did my middle finger, but I wasn't. So I'm going to show you guys exactly how I achieved the ombre by demoing it on my index finger. So I took the same light shade of pink that I just used on my ring finger and I am going to be placing it right where the free edge of the natural nail meets the extension and I'm going to work that poly gel all the way to the edge of the nail tip making sure to maintain my shape as I go along making sure that poly gel is laid nice and even and when I'm happy with the way that it looks I am going to go ahead and pop my hand into the light and I did cure it for a full 30 seconds. Now I'm going in with this slightly darker shade and I'm going to place this to the cuticle area. Now you do not need a lot to achieve this ombre because I still have to go in and encapsulate with the clear poly gel. So if I do need to remove, I'm going to be removing and if I do need to add, I'm going to be adding as I go along. Now the key to this is making sure that you build up your cuticle area and then dip your brush into that slip solution so that you can add a little bit of pressure to create that fade now i do have a video showing you guys exactly how i achieve my ombres using poly gel and i would link it in the cards on the screen so you guys can go ahead and check that video out after i complete this nail i am going to pop my entire hand into the light and cure it for a full 60 seconds just to make sure everything is nice and cured and then i'm going to go in with the clear poly gel and i'm going to encapsulate all my nails 
now i must say after working with this clear poly gel in this kit i am in love with it it is one of the most translucent clear poly gels i have ever worked with and i said this i think in my last review that i did with the mccart clear poly gel but this one is even clearer than that one and i absolutely love that glass finish that i get when i use this to encapsulate and i did include the top coating parts at the end of the video so you definitely want to stay tuned for that so you guys can see how clear this poly gel really is So you won't see Cause the pain is in my eyes It feels like I could break it any moment And shatter your insides If you feel my mind Call me on now Make you cry, and I don't wanna fight with you. 
so these are the nail straight out of the light all i did was use my 99 percent alcohol and remove that tacky layer i did go in off camera file shaped and buffed and at this point i was a little bit stuck so i did do a poll on instagram asking you guys if you wanted nail art or crystals and you guys chose crystals and it wouldn't be fair to myself to close off 2019 without my obsession of cuticle bling because i found like the ombre was so simple and cute and i really didn't want to do too much bling on it so i just went in with a simple ring around the cuticle area with those macart rhinestones and of course i use my macart rhinestone gel it is amazing i would not stop boasting about this and you need to get your hands on it and i do link it in my description box below so you definitely want to go ahead and check that out these stones hold like my clients have their nails for an entire month and these stones do not go anywhere so i definitely highly highly suggest you get your hands on some of these before they are sold out so that is it for me i'm going to leave you guys right here to watch the rest of this video and we are closing off 2019 with a bang this is my last upload for the year and i really want to thank you guys for being with me throughout this entire process this year has been a little bit challenging and emotional at the same time when it comes to youtube but we stuck it out and we are here we are still going so we are going to be closing off 2019 at 31,500 subscribers and i really and truly appreciate each and every one of you the support the comments the likes the shares even just taking that time to subscribe and making sure that you're part of the notification squad i really appreciate it we are heading over to 2020 for bigger and better things and we're going to be more glamorous next year than we were this year so i want to wish each and every one of you a very happy 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 new year and i hope to see each and every one of you when i post my first video for the year of 2020 so until then as always i would love for you to stay glamorous be safe and i'll see you soon